Welcome to Daily Bible Benefits. Today is Wednesday, April 10th. On this day in 1975, 41-year-old Lee Elder becomes the first black golfer to play in the Masters considered the most prestigious event in the sport. Today on the podcast, I'll be talking about encouragement to give generously, 2 Corinthians chapter 8, verses 1 through 15. Moreover, brethren, we do you to wit of the grace of God bestowed on the churches of Macedonia, how that in a great trial of affliction the abundance of their joy and their deep poverty abounded under the church riches of their liberality. But to their power I bear record, yea, and beyond their power they were willing of themselves, praying us with much entreaty that we would receive the gift and take upon us the fellowship of the ministering to the saints. And this they did, not as we hoped, but first gave their own selves to the Lord, and unto us by the will of God. And so much that we desired Titus, that as he hath begun, so he would also finish in you the same grace also. Therefore, as ye abound in everything in faith, in utterance, and in knowledge, and in all diligence, and in your love to us, See that you abound in this grace also. I speak not by commandment, but by occasion of the forwardness of others, and to prove the sincerity of your love. For you know the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, that though he was rich, yet for your sake he become poor, that ye through his poverty might be rich. And herein I give give you my advice, for this is expedient for you, who had begun before not only to do, but also to be forward a year ago. Now therefore, now therefore perform the doing of it, that as there was a readiness to will, so there may be a performance also of that which ye have. For if there be first a willing mind, it is acceptable according to that a man hath, and not according to that he hath not. For I mean not that other men be eased, and you burden, but by in equality, that now at this time your abundance may be a supply for their want, that their abundance also may be a supply for your want, that there may be equality, as it is written, He that hath gathered much hath nothing over, and he that hath gathered little hath no lack. Given in praying. A clergyman once entered a meeting in behalf of four missions. Just as the collectors of the offering were taking their seats, the chairman of the meeting requested him to lead in prayer. The old gentleman stood hesitantly as if he had not heard the request. It was repeated in a louder voice, but there was no response. It was, however, that Mr. Sewell was fumbling in his pockets, and presently he pronounced a... Presently, he produced a piece of money which he deposited in a contribution box. The chairman, thinking he had not been understood, said loudly, I did not ask you to give, Father Sewell. I asked you to pray. Oh, yes, he replied, I heard you, but I cannot pray till I have given something. Thank you for tuning in to Daily Bible Benefits. Have a good and godly day.